this session will be will be discussing about the weight comment weight creating this See here we will be having the weight packets here we have three condition weight per condition weight per spin strength and the weight per window i will be going with the weight per window See here how it will work is wait for window to open and here assume that i'll be defining the 15 seconds it will wait for 15 seconds to open a particular window if it is open within five seconds it will move on with the next command if it is not opening within 15 seconds then if we select this checkbox it will throw the error if we don't select this checkbox it will Go with the next tab, next line. So assume that. Uh, let me take the notepad, make it clear this. So here I'll say open if Facebook I wrote it. Okay. The second line I'll say that way to open if we for 15 seconds. Automate if and fourth line is error block. Okay. Okay. Assume that I wrote this one and here I am waiting for 15 seconds. Within 15 seconds, okay. If this uh, FB base is opened, then it will go to the line number three. That like this. Okay. Assume that after five seconds, this window FB window has been opened. Without wasting remaining ten seconds, it will go to line number three. Assume that after fifteen seconds also the window is not opened, but still it goes to the line number three and it will throw the error at line number three. If I don't select to go to error block, instead of that, if I say go to error block after 15 seconds also this window is not open the control will go to directly here it won't go to line number three. i'll show you that okay let me how can i do this is for, for make you understood this first i'll take the error handler the handling package i'll take the try and catch try to Catch also there. Catch. Designing to the sample string. Simple. I will be printing. So, I think so now I need to use the wait feature inside the try block. Okay. Error handler block is ready. So this time what I'll do is open In the browser command. I'll take the open. I'll say the new tab in this uh, particular browser. Here I want, or else I'll say the new window itself. In the Chrome browser, okay. Go to that Facebook. Okay. Save it. Let me run this. What would be the title of the window? The window. Now, what I'll do is I'll take the wait command. Wait. Here, I'll say that wait for window to open. That is that is a browser window, right? That's the reason I'll be choosing that. My window. 
This is my bot. Now let me close this Facebook window and let me run it. Bot with the others, okay. Some others are there. Okay, the reason is what has has to do. It has to click on it. Okay. I'm running it now. Once window open, go on click on that particular notification button. Maybe because of the object customization, it is not able to identify that. Okay, see, it's identified and it's clicked on the notification button. Okay. Assume that what I will do is to create the error to interrupt the bot. Here I am just putting one message box. After opening, okay, I'm closing this window manually. So, in the line number three, it will wait for 15 seconds as window is not found. It will go to the next step. That means line number five to click on the notifications button. Because in the wait command, I didn't select the error handler checkbox. Okay. And now we'll get the error at line number five. <laughs> there also will be a So, server cannot find window or application title Facebook during the recording. That's what it's for. So, here. Let me print the message box also so that uh, I mean line number also so that it may give more clarity to us. Okay, so let me select the sample number, the message box, at the line. But I have to select here. Here on the don't want to wait. Okay. 
and if we observe it here i didn't selected the throw exception okay if i run this the line name the error will come at line number five okay because i haven't selected the throw exception feature inside the wait command so i'm closing this It will wait for 15 seconds to open the Facebook window. It's not open within 15 seconds. It will go to the line number 5 because I haven't selected the throw header feature at line number 4. If I selected the throw header feature at line number 4, it won't go to the line number 5. Directly it will go to the line number 6 and it will handle the error. As I haven't selected the throw header feature, it will go to the line number 4 and there the error will be taken because window is not open. The same thing it went to the line number five. Trying to click on that particular notifications button on top of the Facebook screen. See at line number five, it throws the error. The same thing. Let's do that. Let me enable this uh, wait feature here. So that means pro exception feature. Here I don't want to waste this many time. Seconds. This time, see what is the error. This time, error is line number. So, like this, we'll be discussing with the wait command. Okay. So, if we select the throw feature here, the error will come at the same wait feature itself. If we don't select this uh, throw feature, the error will come in the subsequent steps as per the what logic. So, this is about wait feature.